All right, hi, and welcome back to Psalms of a Servant. I'm kidding. It's not welcome back to you because this is brand new. This is a new thing that we're doing called Psalms of a Servant. It is a blog cast, so that means that it's partial blog and partial not cast. It's partial podcast. Goodness. <laughs> I have literally recorded like 50 intros and I hated all of them. I'm still getting used to this, you know, being on a mic thing with the camera and it's just it's a little it's a little different, but I'm really excited for it. Um today, literally, I just want to tell you about what it is and how we got here. So stay tuned. So if you know me, you know that I'm really big on well, Jesus, first off, all glory and honor to him because changed my whole life. And if you know me, you know I'm really big on documenting everything. Um, I do a lot of different things. You know, I have a lot of different gifts, but all of those, all of everything is nothing without him. So this blog cast is my way to kind of document my life, my testimony, everything that I'm learning right now and share it while also focusing on acknowledging God, praising God, worshiping God for all that he's done and all that he's taught me. So I believe that this came from this being this pod blogcast came from a collection of things. Um, it really started when I sat down and I really thought about everything that God has taught me in the last few years. And it just made me feel so so grateful but I was also so moved to share that with people and I was just like how do I share this with people like I've learned so much I've acquired so much wisdom and it's just it can't just be for me just for my benefit so that's really how it started it, it was just like a little like I guess nugget just in my head and I was just thinking that I was like I really want to share everything that you've done God like everything that you've taught me I want to share it and I want to you know praise you I want to you know help other people who may be in some of the situations that I was in so all of that combined with the creative ability that he's given me is how this was born okay, let's talk about how it's going to work I guess logistically um <laughs> how it's going to work is there will be two parts. I already said that the blog and the podcast. So the blog part of it will be kind of the artistic writing portion of it, whereas the podcast will be me explaining and detailing, you know, what happened and how like God, you know, came in and saved the day, which he always does, or just was just an amazing part of the that part of my life um and the reason why I'm doing it this way is really because of how Psalms is written in the Bible so um that was actually a huge inspiration to me and the reason why I created the blog in the first place the blog didn't always start as a blog cast it started as a blog but you know, maybe we'll get into that at a later time, or maybe it doesn't really matter. But um, just for this episode, I'm just gonna just talk about, you know, the foundation of it so that you know. And if anybody else wanted to do a broadcast or something, you know, you'll have the information. Anyways, going back to songs in the Bible, um, a lot of times you'll see the the person credited with writing a lot of the Psalms is David. So a lot of times you'll see him write a psalm and it'll correlate to a time that we can see previously or yeah, previously in the Bible. What I mean by that is it, it was actually in church. We were reading a psalm and I cannot remember which one it is right now. I will, I would, I should have looked that up. But in the psalm, he was talking about how God is his refuge and he was praising God and acknowledging God for um, bringing him through the situation that he was currently in. And my pastor, he was like telling us about the context of the psalm. And he was saying that this is when he was running away from Absalom or Saul. And 
I that's when it all kind of clicked for me. And I was like, I was like, wow. Now what I want, what I, you know, wanted to do makes sense. I was like, I get it, God. I was like, hey, you're a genius and it already exists. So I'm basically doing the same thing that David is seen doing in um, Psalms, but I'm providing the context for the the Psalm right at the same time. Like, I, it's like, it's as if it's, it's <laughs> not me glitch it out. It's like, if you would have wrote, writ- if they would have written the Bible in a way where you would see David go through whatever and then you would see his psalm. Um, I wonder if there is a Bible that exists like that. I've read the chronological Bible before. That was pretty cool. I, I love reading things like that. But <laughs> relating it back to Psalms of a Servant, I found myself writing in a very, um, I guess you could say, creative way. And that is the part that I want to be the blog. The blog will be like my my prayers are often poems or they're um, just like creative writings and just like all that. But the podcast part will be where I actually sit down and talk about, you know, what happened. I hope that all made sense. I said a lot in four minutes. So <laughs> And I also kind of highlighted on the why, like the why is that I were like I really want to credit God with everything, like everything. I already had an idea of the next couple of Psalms of a Servant, um, Psalm of the Psalms of a Servant posts that are gonna come out next. The last one that I did, I actually did everything that I just told you, but I did it all in the blog. So I told you about how the blog is going to represent more of the creative side, whereas I'll explain more in the podcast. I I literally, in the blog, you can look at it. What I did is I explained in the blog, and then I showed you the um, creative writing, just acknowledging and praising God for what he's done, because he did a really good thing. Um, that one is called Psalm of an Almost Married Girl. I just know I've learned a lot in the last few years, and I'm just going to keep learning even more. I know I'm not done. I used to do this thing called Officially Growing Up. Um, this is kind of a continuation of that. Um, it just kind of took a different turn, and I don't mind it. Uh, all of this, I really didn't sit down and you know, was so adamant in making something, like things just started to fall in line. And I believe that's just the Holy Spirit working. And the result of God's work is Psalms of a Servant. And I'm going to be obedient and do this. And I believe it's going to be great. I hope that is edifying for everyone, including myself. And I'm just really excited. So come back next week or (laughs) whenever, when the next episode will drop. This was just like a little intro. I guess you could call it a trailer of sorts where we're just talking about what it is because I didn't want to just come out with like, you know, an episode or something and there's like no clarity or accountability on like what this is. So that's kind of what I'm doing right now, just giving you a little introduction. Um, What I do want to do, I do want to go back to Psalm of a Married Girl and just talk a little bit more about that in marriage and engagement and dating and, you know, all that God has done there. Because, look, he can't get enough glory for there because, (laughs) woo. If you don't know what I mean, just go read that blog right now. Yeah. It was rough, man. But yeah, so I think that will be episode two. I have a lot of different things. I wear a lot of different hats. So there's going to be a lot of Psalm of a this and Psalm of a that. You know, I, I want to do Psalm of a teacher, Psalm of a dancer, Psalm of a, a 
daughter. I don't know, you know, a lot of different hats, a lot of different hats that we all wear. And I really, I relinquish this to God. Like he can take this wherever he wants to take it. There are no restrictions like for him, meaning (laughs) not saying like, you know, no, no, no. I mean, he can do whatever he wants to do with this and he knows it. So we're just going to see you know, what he does and where I'm led. So that's all I got for this little episode. I'll see you in the next one.